So Jansen, um, split this weekend. Just what did you see in the two games? Um, yeah, I think uh, a little bit of good and bad. I think um, it was nice to get back at home and play some games. And at the same time, I think uh, we have a lot to improve on. But uh, I think the room's doing pretty well. We've had a good week so far. And uh, yeah, just looking forward to next week. Lots been said actually about the room and uh, and how close the guys are already and uh, the sort of vibe in that room. Can you just give us a little bit more on uh, on what seems to be working in terms of that? Um, yeah, I just think a good group of guys. I mean, uh, a lot of older guys again this year uh, coming in and a lot of new guys as well. So uh, it's just kind of getting to know everyone and getting some chemistry and, and gelling as a team. And um, yeah, I think we got a good group and uh, it should be a fun year for sure. A uh, lot of new players, especially in the forward group yourself, you're on a line with two guys that weren't here for most of the year last year. Do you think that's necessarily harder than, for example, another line where it's one guy joining two guys that were here last year or somewhere in between both have their challenges? Yeah, I think anytime lines get changed up, it's, uh, it's a pretty big deal. I think chemistry is a big part of hockey and um, it's such a fast game out there, especially at this level. At, and uh, everything's happening fast and um, there's no really set plays too much. So you kind of have to read off each other. So it's definitely a lot better. Uh, when you know the guys you're playing with. Is there a way that you can, as a guy that's been in the system previously, sort of help the new players uh, as they sort of make their way into it? Yeah, for sure. I think um, my second year now, so still uh, not too experienced, but uh, definitely feeling a bit more comfortable now and um, just kind of in terms of playing this level and, and getting closer uh, um, to kind of knowing the city and just kind of the ins and the outs of um, this league and, and pro hockey is a lot different than any other level. So. Uh, it's been a good uh, transition so far. It's been pretty tough, but um, I think I'm coming around uh, the right side of it, so feeling good. And yeah, I mean, the younger guys kind of all know what they're going through, uh, similar things we did. So uh, just kind of talking to them and, and having fun with it is, is a big part of it. Uh, we talked about how you're feeling. Last year was a weird year for sure for you in terms of uh, uh, you had a bit of a health scare in the middle and did the conditioning since you're all over the place. So um, how are you feeling now and, and are you excited about the season that way? Yeah, it was, it was a whirlwind of a year for sure. I mean, um, no one really goes into the year expecting uh, injuries or anything like that or ups and downs. So um, you kind of just want to keep making a steady pace up. And um, I mean, that's, that's hockey, that's life. So I uh, had a pretty... Uh, yeah, I mean, long year. I think it was uh, it was a bit nagging, but feeling good now and um, pretty comfortable with our coaches and, and the system and our team and all the guys. So uh, I'm feeling good, and hopefully that can show on the ice. Two game weekend coming up, but again with a break in between them. Are those a little bit easier than the the back to backs? Yeah, I think. Uh, well, we've had two 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 weekend games, and um, the back end of them have been pretty ugly. So uh, it'll be nice to kind of get a switch up and and, and try to get some. Uh, get some working on, on the Saturday there to get ready for Sunday. But yeah, I think we just kind of have to figure out what we need to do to, to play better on those back-to-backs. And that comes with kind of time and just knowing the group. And uh, I'm sure the coaches will handle that.